Glittering Treasures Museum of Tang Dynasty of Shanxi History Museum, the famous guest map attracted our attention. It was the national treasure cultural relics, the only visual material recording the diplomacy of Tang Dynasty. In the past, we could only see its miniature in textbooks, but now it's so lucky for us to see it up close. The map of guest envoys was unearthed from the tomb of Prince Zhang Huai in 1971. It is 1.85 meters high and 2.47 meters long. The figures in the picture are life-size. It is on display these years when the exhibition conditions are ripe. The mural shows the grand scene of the coming dynasties in all directions in the Tang Dynasty. When archaeologists saw it, it was like a treasure and cherished it very much. There are altogether two maps. Why were they painted in the tomb of Prince Zhang Huai? According to records, Prince Zhang Huai was the sixth son of Gaozong Emperor and the second son of Wu Zetian. He was the most gifted of the four sons and was adept with both the pen and the sword. He was once in charge of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. So it is not surprising that the precious pictures appear in his tomb. On the map, the three people on the left were the officials of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in the Tang Dynasty. It was rare that the officials wore court clothes, dragon crowns, having an imposing appearance, seeming to discuss something important. The three people on the right came from foreign countries. Their posture and position standing shows a close relationship with the Tang Dynasty. Xinlo 所以他应该是唐朝的第一友好国西壁的克斯托第一位就是突厥第二位呢是土伯还有最后一位就是胡然胡然就是西域这一带出唐的时候唐朝的军事政治重点就在北方地区南方已经基本没有像咱们越南这一带那都是咱们的俘虏The Silk Road was prosperous in Tang Dynasty the two maps combine diplomatic, territory, and prosperity of Tang Dynasty, providing precious historical materials for the study of Tang history.